so here we get on to the second part now of the video so here we're actually going to be doing the drilling so the first piece we're going to drill is in the top of this uh, CO2 chamber so this is now 3.5 millimeter drill bit so remember when we measured this it was 3.2 millimeters so we're going to drill that bigger we're going to drill this little um, breech port bigger as well as well as we're going to drill the breech as well as the barrel a little bit bigger as well so one thing we just need to be careful of is uh, I'm going to drill these two together as one piece the reason I'm going to do that is that's going to make sure that they line up nicely so what I'll then do afterwards I'll remove the barrel just clean it out on the inside to make sure that there's nothing obstructing inside there what I did also buy is these two little uh, grinding stones so that we can also use to help us just to clean out if we need to all right so the first two I think are going to be fairly easy to drill I'm not even gonna clamp it up Just nice and slow. Okay, now that 3.5 is not really doing much. Let's move it up then. Let's go to the 3.8. Do you also have a 4mm drill here? Let's see. inside there you'll see we're all the way through now just want to clean it up a little bit one thing you do need to remember is that uh, you will need to do all three parts you can't only do this or only do the breech port you need to do all three all right so that's that one done let's now do this one so i do believe this is going to be fairly soft as well okay not soft enough all right i'm going to quickly clamp this up twist this around like this
nicely. It's quite hot. All the way through the breech port as well. So that's also now 3.8 millimeters. Right, then last but not least, what do you do? This here. So again, I'm just going to go nice and slowly. So here we're going to be drilling through two kinds of metal. We've obviously got the got uh, the actual breech itself which is kind of like aluminium very soft and then we've got the barrel as well so it's going to go nice and slow So we threw the aluminium now. If you have a look inside there, you'll see we basically gone through the aluminium. We're just touching now on the barrel itself. So let's just go through the last bits of the barrel. Right. So there you have it, all the way through both the barrel and the breech so yeah now I guess uh, just clean it up and then let's give it a test all right so finished drilling everything the last thing I want to do just gonna shorten this thread ever so slightly I'm gonna take off about half of that thread it just allows us to have a little bit more volume inside the co2 chamber so we quickly do that and then we can start to assemble everything again. off. I'm just going to smooth it out with a flat file and then just give it a nice shape for again. Right, so there we go, nice and flat again. Just gonna, just gently. Just to chamfer this. This is just to make sure that the threads go in easy. This is a very, very, very soft um, material, so <coughs> really doesn't take that much effort. Let's see how it goes. There we go. Still nice and smooth, so definitely no hassles there. Alright, so let's go put it back together and then we'll have a test.